You rolling? Tell me, motherfucker. All right. What's up, y'all? Mike Monday. Episode 22. 22 weeks of this shit. Um, nice and early. About to head down to Venice, to Gold's Gym. I was about to say Venice Gym. Uh, Venice Beach. Gold's Beach. I'm all fucked up. Not woke yet. But anyway, uh, Simeon and Panda and I are going to get it in real quick. Um, the other day, me and Big Boy got it in. Y'all can check that video, link in the description. I'm doing more collabs with my boys, with my squad, with guys I really fuck with these days in 2020, so expect a lot of that. Anyway, I'm just making some grub. Shout out to Pride Foods, good friend of mine on this company, um, Sean Vasquez. And this is really, really good. It's so good that we're carrying it on our site, on Ambrosia Collective. And um, it's cereal. It's cereal. If you ever have cream of wheat, it's just like that. But it's rice, not wheat. So people with uh, uh, wheat allergies or gluten issues, you don't have to worry about that. It is delicious. And I just mix some planta with it to get my protein with it. So some really fast acting carbs and protein. Perfect pre-workout or post-workout. I'm going I'm to have it right now. And it tastes amazing. Put a scoop of that in there. Throw a scoop of planta. You like my accent planta? I said it right. Some water. Microwave it in your Gucci. I like it kind of thick, so I don't put too much water. So, no more one meal a day because I am preparing for a fight in two months and I need the, the sustenance, the energy, the food. So, I don't know how many times I'm going to eat. That is to be determined. It will be based on how I feel and like my activity level for that day. So, for those that are interested, so fascinated in how Mike eats, you'll find out. And I'm a little congested because I was sick. Still getting over it. But it's going to be okay. Everything's going to be all right. All right, let's roll. Hey man, you gotta stop buying all these cars, it's man. It's the same car, man. <laughs> it's the same car, man. Oh, oh you got rid of the white one? I wrapped it, I wrapped it. Oh, you wrapped yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, I wrapped it, man. Damn, this thing look crazy it black, man. Crazy. You feel like I got brand new car just like that. It look good, dog. Thanks, I'm gonna yeah. see you in there. Right, Making all that damn noise. Excuse me, sir, your car's too loud. <laughs> Nobody got their phones on. <laughs> so, well, look who it is. Big fan, bro. Who's McLaren is that? Good. Yesterday I was in Vegas with McLaren, and I was driving their. Let's go. My name's Casey. I was driving their 2020 GT with Lando oh, Norris. So the GT. What's your? Which one is that? This is a GT, but this is the 570 GT. So I don't think it's as fast as. The I won't be. Mine's tuned as well. So, but no. I'm, but it's but it's sexy, and yeah. this is like a daily driver. And I was with Lando Norris, their F1 racer. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. he was driving with me. Yeah. And even he is like, he drives, he's got the 620. Yeah. That's his like 720. Mean, yeah. 720. McLaren. What's, what's the one that starts with 605? There's no six. There's no There's six. There's 600 LT, actually. So that's the one he has. He's okay. 600 yeah, LT. Yeah. But he said it's like, it's not as fast, but holy shit, is it comfortable? Oh, it looks it. I mean, it's a GT, so. I mean, yeah. we were going over speed bumps. Yeah. And we were driving around Vegas where there was like all kinds of potholes and shit. And this thing is like, I was in the, uh, not the Aventador, I was in the um, Huracan last Huracan. week. Okay. That yeah. thing's a yeah. bitch to drive. Yeah, you it's not. not this. Yeah, no, it's, they're not, they, they, you can daily drive them, but it's not going to be com Sexy comfortable. Sexy car, I non -comfortable. Felt, I felt like it was comfortable. I drove it for about the, a week. The Huracan? Yeah. You liked it? I, I, mean, I could do I'm it. I'm not a sports car guy, no, it's but not, it's it was not, comfortable. It's, it's not for, nah. Like really? mine's comfortable. Okay. You're I, thought, no, comfortable. I thought, I thought the Huracan was more comfortable than yours. Ah, no, Were you, was it the no. was it the convertible or was it the regular ah, one? Yeah. So the convertible, you lose six inches of leg room. Oh wow! Not, you know lot. that? That's, that's terrible. Actually a lot. I'm five eleven. When I say I comfortable, though, I don't mean leg room because even me, I'm six one, and in both the Lambo and mine, I've always mm. felt comfortable. But I'm talking about the drive, the drive as yeah. in being smooth and just being able to take it round the town, and yeah. Yeah. yeah, and speed bumps and things like that. Ground clearance, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I was just in a, a, a fucking 911, 
when they was doing the rims. Yeah. And I was like, I get me out of here. You didn't, oh, you didn't like, like it? it. No. You don't like it. Just, it's, I'm, it's claustrophobic. Okay. You know? Okay. It's small. It's small, but the not yeah. the Porsche is known as like the daily driver sports car. That's yeah, of course. Got. That's what yeah, that's got. a daily driver. I'm not. You know. Yo, dude. Gentlemen. How are you? I got. I drive the Tesla, which is the. Um, nice to see you. Which one? Good to see you. I got the three performance. Okay. So it's the it's the stoplight king. He'll beat anything off the line to say. Yeah, people always trying to race me, man. I'm like, look, I don't want it. Sure. Like, I don't want it. Let's, right. Like they're, they're always that. Like oh, and you don't. The thing is, the difference is they can do that because no one hears them. No so you, they get to have that little bit of fun of acceleration, and no police is going to look over. I accelerate. Everyone's yeah. going to see. It. Everyone knows that like, I did it. It looks like it looks like a Honda Civic. It but, doesn't yeah, look true. like a sports car. True. But see, I I want to get. It. I want to get nah, no, don't I don't care. Don't I don't. They don't fuck with me though. Nah, nah, nah. Is that I your feel, car? Yeah, I feel like it's a sleeper. Like people are like, oh, that a me. Like, That's okay. a beast. And uh, I, I, I don't care. Yeah. I just have fun. I, love it, I don't. Man. I don't get on the freeway yeah. often. So okay, know. I'm always always. Yeah. The, the, the Tesla's worthless on the freeway. Anything over sixty? Oh, yeah? I mean, it's it's quick. But it's just that, that initial yeah. acceleration. It's just, it's yeah. just off oh. the line. You know what is the worst car in the world? They try to get me to buy this i8. Oh, this, Fuck that. this is dope. You know? look, no, no, no. The look, right? We was in Miami. Yeah. That was a. I was like, this piece of shit. What the? It's a I've snub. not driven it, it, it but I've never gold. had a, a, a liking for it. A, 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 a speaker to make oh, it sound, for the like sound yeah. like You know what's in it for an engine, right? Nothing. A three cylinder combustion engine combined with a tiny electric engine. It's the worst of both worlds. It, it, <laughs> the worst. Of, I did a hot lap in that thing. It feels and blew like one of the cylinders. It feels like. Oh, wowza. Well, so. It it's a like, weak yeah. car. It's all it and is. And they is have pretty. they Nothing have else. a generic version of the you know the effervescent lighting you know, yeah, the shady, yeah. they try to I'm like, don't do that. Don't it's not it's, it was just yeah. terrible. It looked it was cute. But this is when they first came out when we, you know It's a it's a pretty it's a pretty car. It's, what do you think of yeah. the, the Tesla sports car that's coming out? He's saying zero to sixty in one nine, quarter mile in eight. Yeah, eight. again, uh, I mean it does look better. It looks nice, yeah. but I don't know if I could um like the sound for me is very important. I love the sound, like the it's sound everything. every day. Like, are you, sound are you, now, are you like, locked you know? in with electric cars? I mean, for the reason you're saying, like, I drive like, I mean, unless my kids are in the car, I drive like a fucking asshole all the time, because it's fun as fuck. <laughs> and there's not enough cops in this town. I used to live in New York City, there's not enough cops here to give you a hard time, and you can just bomb. In an electric car, nobody, nobody looks. Yeah. And my buddy, my, my friend's hurricane is very electric blue. Mm. You go 35 miles an hour now, you're getting pulled over. Oh, wow. Well, yeah. Cause it's just loud and it looks yeah. like a race car. Yeah. So I'm. That's why I drive electric. Mike, Mike good Mike to meet you, Mike. Yeah, this is Simi. We both do too. Yeah, both see you, what's man. up, Casey? How you doing, man? Travel. Good to see you. Yeah. I, you think, make I think you turned yeah, me on. Yeah, yeah. You turned me on to you yeah. like years ago. Yeah. I appreciate that. Yeah, bro. I just moved here. Off of one of. Nice to meet you, Off of realizing that when you go through the airport on your skateboard, I said they would never let me do that. <laughs> but you just slide through right. every day. The video I'm making today is about going to Vegas, and I wanted to have the skateboard with me in Vegas because you can't get around there without it. And I mm. took it apart into like 10 pieces. Damn. And it's the only way you can get it past security. Nice Great to meet, to meet you, man. Nice all the best, man. I'll see you guys around. I'm here all the time. Nice Take to care, meet man. you. All right, we are at the Mecca, not Saudi Arabia, <laughs> LA, Gold's Gym. My man Simeon Panda. We just ran into KC Neistat. How crazy is that? And I'm a fucking fan of KC Neistat, real talk. Anyway, we're gonna get, uh, arm, get in some arms. We've all been training our asses off, so arms is kind of a light day, maybe. But y'all just enjoy the ride and have some fun with us. That's what we're here to do. I watched your Mike Monday's video, and um, I don't know what video I've watched since then. Uh -huh. I mean, what before that? But I've noticed there's a style, there's a new yeah, style, yeah, yeah. and the new style is dope. What do you guys think? Because I, I, I watched it yesterday, and I was like, I love this style. This, 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 this it's is more fun, slick. flowing, yeah. And, and this guy is responsible. You can't see him right oh, now. Tea. Yeah, no. You're... Go ahead. Yeah, we... And I'm like, yeah, it's a new style. Right. It's a, it, it looks slick, man. I'm yeah. like I was watching a TV show. Yeah, yeah, that's what we're trying to make. We make it more lucid, more fun. Salute. Everybody trying to step it up, you know what I mean? Mm. I wish we would have had a, 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 a light 
for the beach. Oh, for the beach. We weren't thinking That's about it though. Wet, but you know what? Because I used cold. to, I filmed on the beach before yeah. with the bonfire. The the fire does it, oh, but okay. I didn't know we was gonna be. They, they're gonna hit us on us with the fire. This is a long fucking goddamn. Yeah, I mean, so, I'm for a giant. Rope because, uh, you like the long ropes? I, like, I get more range with it. When okay. It's, yeah. Do you grab at the bottom? No. Okay. But even still, like the other ones, are sometimes just too short. I got, I got you. Yeah. It's funny, the people following me, they're not gonna know who Casey Neistat is. They're not gonna give a fuck, but, but oh, oh well. Opposite of Ben Popish, I spit clear metaphors like a pen polish. We call the pen college real G's move in silence. Ain't trying to talk about she. We just resort to violence. Little cameo for my brother right here. Uh. <laughs> my African brother right here. Yeah, that's right. That's right. <laughs> Remember. Yup. Clear persona. Death is right around the corner. I don't succumb to flesh of death. I'll never take me from you. Infinity, the minor sin city. Be aligned with the Mau Mau's in the penitentiary. But I'm a free man. Man, the range car seat is tan. Dirty angels repping CSA peace found. Facts. That's the G code when we roll the sleep though. Each bar C4. King is unbelievable. I feel like I feel like me and Simbi, we be low-key battling with shoes. <laughs> <laughs> he has a fresh shit on. I'm like, okay, okay. I ain't seen those yet. All right. Yeah, no, I got, All right. Like four pairs in one go. Oh, yeah? Kicks. Yeah, I like yeah, those. One of them. Hey, it ain't nothing like a crispy new pair of shoes. Oh, 100%. You know what I mean? It's just a, it's a thing. Do you ever get this? Because this pisses me off. I buy it. Uh huh. I plan to rock it. When it comes to rocking it, I'm like, you it, know it, what? Yeah, you can't pull I it off. Like yeah, <laughs> I done it. And I'm like, oh, shit, I got a fresh pair of kicks. And it's been like, like you know, I don't know what the, the, the return policy is, whether it's like but, but but Nike is like good. Fast. Nike, they they're awesome. good. You're good. Run the stack, baby. I got a thing. Whatever pin loaded, anything I use, <laughs> I, I got to run the stack. Got to run the stack. Nice. This is great. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. Nice. See how we're doing it is a lot harder than normal because typically you have a shorter rope and you have you have leverage right here. But we don't got leverage. It's all grip strength, which is good. You want you want legit grip strength. So Southwest vet had it. Black Travis, Barker with an automatic. Yeah. They won't static. That's what Bond let them have it. They lack passion. Your bars have no magic. No frills. Ballers with no. Bro, I did chess with a big boy yesterday. Yeah. Five plates. You go five? Him. Oh, him. Snap. For three. Easy. Not easy, but smooth. That man's strong. Nice. We should, uh, me, you, and him should do a back video. Some deadlifts, yeah. yeah. That's his thing. I need to start back deadlifting. Have you been deadlifting? Yes, I brought it back. I, I gotta start back. It's, it's so, like, I've been doing bring, light. When you bring it back, yeah. it's depressing, man, because <laughs> you're like, the shit's not moving how it's supposed right, to. Right, 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 right. Patient. Yeah. Because for me, week on week, it's got better. Okay. So, you know, it's gotta be patient with it. Push it too hard, you're gonna mess yourself up. Yeah. I need to get back on it though. Yeah, hold on, hold on. 
Yeah. What's up, brother? How you doing, man? How are you doing? Good. Brother? Yourself? Good. Same to you, brother. Same to you. What's up, sir? How, How you doing, man? You good? Good. Yourself? Good to see you, man. I like your is, interview on Cameron Oh, thank you. Is Jay still here? No, nah, he been back here on Monday. Oh, okay, okay, cool. I think I saw you though. All right, thanks. Anyway, it felt like I was gonna have a heart attack. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yes. I had to sit down. After the workout, I had to sit for like 20 minutes. But here's the thing, I know they go way harder than, than Dex and, and Charles. Oh, okay, okay. I know that, because these guys are young, yeah. IFBB, yeah. yeah, animals, yeah. They're both with a uh, mutant, you know what I'm saying? Okay. I'm not saying this shit gonna be easy, but I'm gonna do it. They do a lot of volume. That's, oh, yes, yeah. Bro, so we did like, say on the hack no, no, squat, right? Dex. Oh, I think so. I, I don't know. I think the test workout we did was a lot of volume. So uh, on a hack squat with the guys, bro, we did, we, you know, started a plate, 20. I just, I wasn't going to stop until they stopped. So we went to like five plates of 20s, all 20s. Leg press, all 20s. And then we did, uh, I like this, we did um, 100 reps of uh, leg extension. Damn, yeah. I'm good. I'm good with with that kind of volume. You know what I mean? But it was like it wasn't 100 straight. Like yeah. quick break, yeah. right back at it. But it was a fucked up leg workout. But it was good. Come on. Come on. Uh. Come on. Nice. Depends on the day for me. If I want to do unilateral work, well. <laughs> Nice, come on. There you go. Nice. Woo! heavy. It's good. Oh shit, you got more? The yeah. reps are getting better as they were going on. There you go. Up. Nice. Oh. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Good set, good set. There you are. God damn. Fuck. Yep. Come on, keep it coming. Double digits, man. Double digits. Yep. Yep. Ah. Yep. Shit. Up, 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 up. Hold on. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. There you go. Nice. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. 
There he is. There he is. Easy money, baby! <laughs> Good shit, baby. Hey, that's called God. That was a God set right there. I feel like I got cement in my arms. <laughs> Man, that pump could be crazy, man. Wow. Bicep pump is something different. I haven't had a bicep pump in so long. I'm talking about since Metroflex days. Oh, okay. That long. Why are you avoiding, Mike? Is it like... It's, uh, I, f I felt a lot of pain for my bicep, like, all in here. Because CT, CT and Rob, they're bigger than me, like, physically bigger guys, right? And I'm doing everything they was doing. I think I kind of hurt some of my joints. So I just stopped. You know, but I do I do stuff, but never like this. You know what I'm saying? But back in the day, we used to. But it would be with barbells and shit, like crazy shit. It goes to show you as well that um, like some people don't have an arm stick. Some people mix it with um, like chest and back. That's me. You know, so but but you can obviously see that we both got big arms, big strong arms. But so. you clearly have bigger arms yeah. than me because you train, you have arm day. It's true. You know what I mean? It's true, but in mind, also, it's, it's, it's that, but it's the fact that when I started, that's what I did. Um, right, right, right. So I knew. I yeah. had dumbbells at home. Yeah. I'll do curls and do um, dips. See, so, and, and my, my thing was chest, chest bench chest, press. Chest. Well, you know what I'm go watch us on chest and you'll see who's the strongest <laughs> study chest. Uh, so, it says a lot. <laughs> but nah, but when it, it's wherever, it's, it goes to show where you put focus at is yeah, what's yeah, going to, you know. 100%. But trust me, by summertime, your boy going to be... But mm. now, we both. Smash legs. Oh yeah, like oh yeah. <laughs> and that wasn't my thing in the beginning. Yeah. No, neither mine. That was, I was a late bloomer. Yeah. I love it, I love yeah, it now. I love it to death. Come on. Come on. That's uh, a little bit lower. It's just the pump is so good. It's a real simple movement that you get the, a lot of bang for your buck here. So it, it keeps you right nice and tight. It's a real simple extension. And the pump is real. And if you can look at it, his entire tricep is uh is engaged, even under here. The majority of your tricep is back here, here and here. This is the third part right here. But the power come from back here. Y'all can see how, how much is engaged. It's just an easy movement that you get so much out of. I love it. This kind of stuff right here, it helps your bench press. It helps your power, okay? Because the driving force for a press is your triceps. The stronger your triceps are, the stronger your presses are going to be, so. Arizona, granddaddy Kush aroma, hood diploma, trap star, street farmers. You can't harm us. Your tough guys is all harmless. Your chest charmless. Your niggas loud, I'm the calmest. I'm the dumb bitch, you niggas just all performers. I'm King Kong, bitch, ass the streets, my buzz are gnomers. Enforce all the code on your informers. I'm the MVP, y'all niggas is bench warmers. See, over the years, you learn tactics, intelligent tactics to get to the games with lighter weight, and this is one of them. This is lightweight, but this is, uh, it feels pretty formidable when you're down there doing it. It don't feel super easy.
Y'all want to adjust the intensity without increasing weight? Come down slower. Come down slower. Um, yeah, uh, when I do train, put the arms in, I usually throw um, triceps in on the back day. And typically, biceps will go in on a chest day or a shoulder day. But it's very rare that I train my biceps, I'll be honest with y'all. But um, I have been, I do want to incorporate my arm days back, you know. I actually have been doing them, but not like intense like this like a real fucking dedicated day when you go heavy, like everything else. Kind of neglecting my arms a little bit, but but my triceps I do train, I just don't train my biceps. Certain people would watch both of our sets and say, what's the point of doing a weight that heavy and not doing it perfect? See, the thing is- That's a good I, question. I, I, I wanna get this right. If we don't do this, then we could never do Let's say something like a, Let, like a 75 yeah. or something. Let's say 70 is our max yeah. doing this. Yeah. We'll never get past that if yeah. we don't, if we don't touch cheat. That. And a lot of you guys that say that, that's where you might be, like, you can do what you like, to be fair. I don't really yeah. care, but you might be missing out on extra strength because you're scared to, you know, give a little leeway with the form on an extra heavy set. Like, no one's trying to claim that that was the perfect set with that kind of weight. But I know for a fact, if I do that, then the weight's just below it will become that much easier because, exactly. you know, I, I, my body's trying to adapt to that heavier weight, meaning this one's going to be easy. It's just, it's a simple logic, you know? So, it's, just a, it's just a tactic and nonetheless, you know, it's not perfect, but we're still getting that work. Oh yeah, 100%. We're still getting that work. People, I've seen people criticize people like Branch Warren and Johnny Jackson on their leg press, short strokes. Look how big they are. Yeah. And forget about steroids, because everybody want to throw that in there. No, it's the work, that heavy fucking weight. It may not be perfect form to your standards or likings, but there is no perfect form. It's a machine or a curl. It's not a competition, right? If we were in a powerlifting competition, that's completely different, right? But we're bodybuilding, we're getting big, right? We're doing what we need to do to get to the games without hurting ourselves. So that's what y'all gotta think. Without hurting ourselves, that's an important thing there. All right, there, there's no injuries here, man. So all you guys talking about Snap City or whatever silly things you say, there's no injuries here, man. I've been training 19 years injury free. So what are you saying? You've probably been training like, I don't know, two years, you injured yourself twice. Right. Times, and then you're telling me to tell someone like me who's been in the game for longer than you've been alive. And we don't me, come into this, train, you know? we don't come into this thinking, oh, I don't want to hurt myself. Yeah. We clearly don't want to hurt ourselves, but we, we, we want to come in and get work, big. Come, come in and put in some work. Yeah. Move some impressive weight around. And that's what we're doing. There's another, uh, Flex Lewis showed me this. We're doing delt raises, right? He was like, bro, grab the heaviest ones yeah. that you could barely awesome. move. And do these. Yeah. I'm like, bro, that looks stupid. I ain't doing that. <laughs> he said, try it. Yeah. I got the fucking biggest pump. I can imagine. Just this. Mm. Right? I got my full rest with the lighter weight, but then I went and grabbed some heavy ones. Yeah. That's a part of my shit now. Yeah, 100%. 100%. You know? It will play into the, 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 everything else everything getting else. easier. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So, Preacher, Preacher come over here with fucking big arms. You motherfuckers put something in the offering. Only the last two reps was difficult to me, but that's what you're doing. You get into, the only ones that work is the difficult ones. So those first eight didn't count. It's warming me up for the hard ones.
Now what I'm doing, y'all, I'm intentionally thinking about squeezing my muscle as I'm coming up. I don't know why that shit feels good. I gotta uh, help myself up. Shit. It's like, it's crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. It's a crazy feeling when you feel strong and confident and then there's nothing there. You're like, nope. The arm says, nope. It's fucking, it's a mind fuck. But this is testament to a good workout. We should be whipping through 40s like it's nothing. But we, we're, I, I'm at least at a legit level of fatigue. And that's what you want. <coughs> we train it to failure. I'm good. And just like that, it's a wrap. We out. I don't know where you gotta go, but you gotta get the fuck up out of here. <laughs>